Hey folks, today we're gonna be doing something we haven't been doing for a while and I'm gonna react to one of the videos but not from a creator you know because this guy is new, this guy has a small channel, approximately 800 subs so if you like his video then definitely subscribe to his channel. I don't know what to expect, he shared the video and he said that this is gonna be super cool. I see on the thumbnail 28 kills so let's go, let's check it out. So the name of his channel is Format and i'm gonna put a link to the channel into the description if you like what you're gonna see then definitely hop over and subscribe to his channel and i feel appreciated because he has been asking me to react to his video and i was like okay why not let's go let's do it i can instantly tell you that he's running t6 so he, it must be a chat i didn't see the video by the way i didn't even see any of the work he's been doing but you know i felt like you're, i'm gonna give him trust in advance and then we'll see all right what substances have you consumed before the game pain definitely arena breakout comes with tons of pain right and uh seems like his in-game name is night killer but uh yeah okay okay maybe it's not gonna be highlights maybe it's gonna be a full gameplay so tv station um fall and i see you know gyro kicking in so he's a gyro player i'm gonna make a video regarding gyro very soon and he's running solo this is interesting because on tv station when i do solo uh i i, I keep dying i mean i do some kills but then i die and i think he already spotted the first victim actually two of them two of them nice nice four control guys so it's 1x scope, but still, I think from this distance, uh, we could say that it's it's actually a nice control. And I, I I like that he keeps constantly checking if there are more enemies. That's, that's pretty cool, pretty dope. In the intro, he was running T6 alien helmet, but now he's running a T5. And I... I don't know the ammunition, maybe we're gonna find out later on, but I would assume he's running M62s eventually. Yeah, we're, we're gonna find out. Maybe we're gonna find out. M61. You saw that? M61. He just checked. I just had to ask him to check. Oh, nice. Nice. Nice, my boy. Pretty cool. So, flashlight and... I, I like the fact that he was running through the smoke and I think he did the voice command now because he expects someone to be on the other side based on the sound print. Yeah. But come on! If I do something like this guys, if I peek or if I, you know, just 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 show my hat to, to the you know in such a situation that T5 Chad is looking at me and destroying me. Anyways, let's move on. So he has already four kills, by the way. Four kills. And I guess... Uh-huh, okay. Like it. I like it. I really like it. The movement, guys. It pretty, pretty much reminds me of what Yusuf is doing. Like, he was baiting to kind of understand, like, the position of the enemy. And then it was, like, you know, aim by the book. Okay. We're switching to armory. Which is cool because I really like players who are not just, uh, you know, just specified on one single map. I mean, not just playing one single map. Th those players are also nice, don't get me wrong, but it's really cool if someone just can play one. multiple maps. He's talking to somebody, so it might be that he actually has teammates. Nice aim. Nice aim, quick aim, quick uh, zoom. Yeah, he had a teammate this time. I like it. I like it. Back to TV station. Mm -hmm. So I guess he knows that there are people in the director's office. So he's just gonna put his P90 into action. Uh-huh. So there you go, guys. There you go. This is how to do it. Don't just run. Just for a single second. You know, do the bait. And then move back to cover. The enemy is gonna start shooting. And then if you have a good enough aim, then basically this is what happens. It takes tons of practice, guys. It takes tons of practice because, you know, it's just it's just hard. But you need to act fast. You need to react fast because 
arena breakout is gonna punish you if you don't do so it didn't show the last kill um i'm not sure what happened i think it might be the same game still maybe he was running around and maybe yeah coming from the other <laughs> lord oh my oh my holy lord what was that that cat and mouse play what was that it rarely ever happens that you run you know so close to the enemy i like it oh vss no scope guys i really hate if somebody is playing this i i mean not if that guy is on my team but if somebody is doing this then it's usually a giga chat type of guy you see that i mean he's using a flashlight no scope and it's always so devastating it's always so freaking devastating to die against somebody who is using this like um you know vss no scope with a tilt uh it it makes you feel so bad if you die so bad and i can i can clearly tell you that he can um read like where the enemies are and he's doing quick decisions and those decisions are good and he's also very good in controlling the game as you can see i i think i definitely think that uh based on his gameplay he deserves um uh, you know more subs so if you are interested to see gameplay where you can see professional gameplay and not the like you know the the constant talking i do uh then you know, definitely worth checking him out because if you keep watching these guys you can definitely learn i mean some sometimes it's like hard to like learn by just seeing but uh yeah i i, I think what 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 the hell was this come on guys this, this was this was unreal i would have i would have and another one i'm freaking speechless guys i would i would uninstall the game or just put it aside if i see this on kill cam or i would report him saying that this is unreal maybe my brain isn't braining fast enough but when he was like standing up i didn't even see the enemy i i guess he knew that he's there but still it was it was performed so fast and yeah I mean, it's not just about aim. Aim is one thing. Mastering the controls is one thing. But look at what he's doing. He exactly knows where the enemies are going to come from. That's the combo you need to learn. It's not enough to have good aim and good movement and controls. First, the very first thing is that you need to understand the game. The, the sound prints and understand, you know, what's going to happen and when. And then, in the right moment, you need to do the right thing. And you need to, like, you know, tell your fingers... And your brain to brain correctly and your fingers to like move correctly again a double kill easy double kill for him i mean with the m61s it's not like you know i mean you know those, those that ammunition is like really devastating and really deadly for the enemies but still you need to hit the enemy right patience patience is key guys patience <laughs> oh my god he shot the guy because before he was able to throw the uh the impact nade and the other guy is chasing him he's closing the door not to get shot by the bots and then uh, stun grenade impact nade but he already knows he this guy he is two steps ahead of the enemy i mean the and and it feels like that the enemies they are also good, good enemies. So it's not that we are talking about Timmy's. Look at that. AX50 uh, and the fall. So the enemies are not like, you know, master level. And, and sorry, guys, I didn't mean to insult you. By master, I'm not saying that those players are bad. I'm getting killed by masters like multiple times. Nice. This is what you need to do let the enemy start the attack spray the bullets you know don't reveal yourself and then you know you can kind of confuse the enemy it's so 
annoying if somebody is doing that body bait like Yusuf is, is constantly doing it's so annoying because you you cannot predict you know the next time he's gonna peek and most likely the next time he's gonna peek he's gonna instantly shoot at you because he precisely knows where the enemy is okay let's keep watching I'm actually enjoying this guys I'm actually enjoying this and um, I hope that at one point I'm gonna be able to play um, at least somewhat like this uh, I'm not saying that I'm like super far away but definitely there is an experience gap I haven't been playing PUBG, COD Mobile and stuff like that so Arena Breakout was the very first uh, FPS game for me I played on mobile and uh, I just recently turned on uh, uh, Gyro or Giro however you say it maximum sensitivity so I'm practicing that and it's getting okay but I I'm not there yet I need an extra thousand hours at least thousand hours this previous attack was cool I mean I like the face-to-face -face, uh, fights a bit more than shooting somebody from the side but yeah it's also part of the game to shoot somebody in the back or in the ass nice very fast again I know it was just a bot but he was very fast like the quick zoom for him is like almost instant zoom reaction nice reaction he sees the nade coming and instantly starts moving nice I don't know why the enemy didn't you know assume that he's gonna be here teammate trying to push as well he's reading the sound prints very nicely nice nice and and whenever you are uh, having this situation don't just push because i often do the mistake that i start pushing or start rushing them but he was like pushing for a second and then moving back to cover which is the right thing to do a very nice second kill and that guy has still a teammate at this point usually at this point is where i sorry i was almost saying something so this is the point where I'm, 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 I'm messing it up. When I already have two kills and I'm not sure if it falls into the gear fear category, but I hate to die if I already have two or three kills and I already picked up some of their stuff. And I don't want to lose the loot I already secured or almost secured. But really nice, in a really nice way. Uh, this was just a guy with a with a construction helmet but still you know these players these enemies are i think they are all ace and legend players nice again nice idea to close the door because he was uh, expecting nades to come i think his gameplay is i don't know what you think guys you know leave leave it in leave some comments of what you think uh, but I think his gameplay is very decent and it reminds me of the like the um, Yusef type of gameplay where you are like not afraid of pushing gyroscope on quick reactions quick movement He doesn't creep walk and stuff like that. He he, he doesn't have to and this makes this game by the way beautiful that there are multiple ways to play this game and i'm not thinking about like the campers and the snipers like the your your pushing um play style can also be different you can be aggressive you can be passive you can be semi-aggressive and i really like that for me he falls into the like into the aggressive group or semi-aggressive because uh, as you can see he he doesn't necessarily push the enemies, but he's holding the angles and he's holding them very, very nicely. Again, he knows the nade is coming and, you know, as at the moment he heard the noise, he didn't have to, th ha he didn't th think to run. He instantly started running to a different location. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I would have absolutely died in this situation i don't know why but uh usually if i get attacked then i like this out of the sudden i usually die because for a second i don't actually know where the shots are coming from and he didn't just kill that guy but he also killed the guy 
who was pushing from behind the guy he was fighting um you know in that pass or corridor i like it i really like the playstyle. i definitely do and i also like that he's playing multiple uh types of weapons so it's not just that he plays full or mk14 and that that's it he was playing p90 he was playing uh before and now I, I guess this is an m4 i didn't pay attention to his gun but uh, it must be an m4 with uh, m955 bullets must be yeah nice very again again very nice and fast movement he knows that they are inside very nice uh you know way of using the nade he knew that the enemy is like at the back of the elevator so it was safe to throw that nade he's actually looking around cool stuff and also guys remember every time he had a kill he he doesn't like instantly run to the enemy okay he, do that i mean don't run straight to your kill always look around secure the area and then you know your chances to to live are gonna be better and i think we we are near to the end of the video let's see how much he's gonna extract with i think it's like close to a million or 1.2 million maybe yeah 1.1 eight 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 operators killed guy eight yeah and as i as you can see legends yeah he, he had one or two experts so folks i really hope you enjoyed this reaction video and this guy he actually deserved it because he's pretty pretty damn good so throw him a like check out his video subscribe to his channel if you like the gameplay and uh, in case you want me to do more of these like you know checking out some unknown creators then you know what needs to be done let me know in the comment section have a nice day shoot loot subscribe see you in the next one ciao bye